up my YouTube family. Like I said in the last video, I'm going to try and do some whiskey reviews. So that's what today's video is, my first whiskey review, so to speak. It's just gonna be me trying this whiskey, or not trying it, but drinking some of this whiskey, telling you what I get on the nose and on the taste, and, uh, and telling you whether or not I like it or don't like it or, you know, whatever. As you can see behind me, I have plenty of whiskeys that I can uh, begin to work my way through. And so that's what we're gonna do. I even have some up top. So we're gonna start working our way through some of those here on the channel. Again, this is the Bearded Gentleman channel, but uh, like I said in the last video, if you can come up with a creative name with uh, the word mustache in it, I am looking to, to change the channel name since I no longer am able to sport a beard. So, without me rambling anymore, the whiskey I'm gonna be drinking today is Bullet Bourbon, their 10 year. Uh, I like Bullet, uh, just their regular stuff with the orange label. I have tried Bullet Rye, which is all right. Um, this is just their Bullet Bourbon it says aged 10 years, so I'm assuming that the youngest whiskey is probably 10 years. Uh, Kentucky Straight Bourbon. Give you a little look at the bottle there. Not a very, very dark whiskey, um, but it is whiskey nonetheless. Let's pour us a little bit here. And get a nose. That's probably good. So, like I said, I do like Bullet, their regular stuff. Um, it's been a while since I've drank, drank any of this 10 year. So, we'll see if, uh, if I like this or not. Okay, so it's been a while since I've actually drank whiskey straight. So off the rip, all I'm kind of getting on the nose is, is that alcohol. Maybe a little bit of apple. Sweet. <clears throat> so like I said in my last video, my palate has deteriorated when it comes to whiskey and cigars. So I will be working to redevelop that. But right now as it sits, let's call this day one of, uh, of recalibrating my palate. Um, and we'll start with whiskey. Why not? So all I'm getting on the nose is, you know, a sweet, uh, kind of apple and that alcohol is just taking over because I haven't drank in so long. So let's get our first little swig. Okay. Okay. So on the first little taste there's a uh, you can taste the barrel a wood note it doesn't seem to be very oily it is got a little bit of a little bit of sweetness really all I tasted was was you know, some nice wood notes. Uh, again, I'm assuming that's because I haven't drank whiskey straight in a while. On the finish, again, not not very oily, but you can that that the wood tannin note or wood wood note, whatever you want to call it, it it, it is lingering. Let's see if we can pick up anything on the uh, on the second taste. Okay. 
the second the second sip there it got really sweet you can still taste the uh, the wood not really so much charred wood you can just taste that that barrel note a little bit of sweetness no real burn not very oily pretty good pretty good I don't really remember exactly how their regular stuff tastes to compare it maybe that's a video uh, in the near future if I can get my hands on a bottle of their regular stuff I'll do a taste test and compare the two this whiskey right here is Forty five point six percent alcohol by volume or ninety one point two proof. It it feels that way. Um, it's not a real throat punch or gut punch. It is very smooth. Um, and from from what I remember, just a very classic bourbon. Okay, so from what I remember from um, you know the last time I had straight whiskey. This is just tastes like a very classic bourbon. Um, while I'm sitting here, after that second second sip, second taste, whatever you want to call it, um, picking up a little bit of vanilla on the finish, along with the, the wood. So all around, just a classic, classic uh, bourbon and really really good stuff like i said it is really smooth there's no real burn um so you could definitely definitely drink this no problem every day but i'm gonna try and do a rating scale when i do these whiskeys so it'll be like one out of ten um this one right here i'm gonna give a 7.5 not the best whiskey I've ever tried, but as far as just a solid, solid drink, I'm gonna give it a 7.5. Definitely drink this, you know, daily if that was my thing. I do enjoy whiskey, but I just don't drink it every day. So, 7.5 on the Bullet 10 year. Um, like I said, in the near future, you can be looking for a video maybe a, a taste comparison between the 10 year and the regular <clears throat> bullet and maybe even the rye if i can get my hands on it um but yeah really good stuff if you enjoyed this video make sure you hit the like button subscribe um we'll be getting back into our regular videos of, of cigars and pipes here shortly this is my first stab at a whiskey review or a whiskey tasting so i'll definitely be doing more of these like i said working my way through the the bar cart there in the little shelf and hopefully purchasing some more to uh to add to the collection but i appreciate you taking the time out your day to come hang out with me uh, if you can think of a creative channel name drop it down in the comment section below something with the word mustache is what i'm looking for um I'm thinking on my end, but if y'all can come up with something clever that makes me laugh or or just sounds really good, I will definitely be open to that. So, to finish this video off, cheers. And have a very, very blessed day.